visit eaglerunnerbill.com. Hey, it's Eagle Runner Bill here. Going to show you how I cleaned my Ford 2000 tractor air cleaner. It's an oil bath type. Just remove that clamp, pull down this little cup. And it was all full of oil. This is my first time, so don't take whatever I say. As a matter of fact, I'm just showing you what I did. You might want to do your own research. And then to my surprise, this filter did not come out of the canister. And I could not figure out how to pull it out and see how scummy it was. So to get that filter clean, I had to remove the whole canister. And I just took, removed the tubes, tubing from the sides. And it was pretty easy. It only had three bolts holding it on. I removed them three bolts and the top top cover of the air pipe. I had to pop that off. Once I got these three bolts out of there, one up top, just tap this cover, tapped right off without any problem. Now I'm able to remove the whole canister. And the canister just easily fell right out. Now, I, like I told you, I couldn't get the filter out. I don't know if I did wrong, but I just took this canister and I put it in a five-gallon bucket about halfway filled with kerosene, and I let it soak for about 72 hours. I took all the bad oil that was in there to my recycle place. And then after it soaked for a few days, I hose it down as hard as I can with a water hose, got it as clean as I can, and then so I didn't have a bunch of rust, I used a hair dryer, dried it all out. From everything I gather, you can use practically any engine oil you want to fill this canister, and that's what I did. All pretty simple, it came out nice and clean. I think I did right because the tractor has been running great since I did this. Just clamped it all and put it all back together. Hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.